Jesus, it's Jerry. Oh my god, that is the fastest anyone has got that. Good job. Like 20 seconds. Dude, were you waiting? 20 seconds. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Yay. Very nice. I hope I hope your appointment went well today, Stu. Let me just get this head running. Gonna play nice. I think it's gonna work. Oh fuck! I don't. Okay. All right. Ads are running. My overlay doesn't think so, but it, oh no, the overlay is working. Oh, okay. Um. All right. Fancy transition. Uh, Stu, you're, uh, I, I, I'd like to hear about it. Um, if there's something you're comfortable with, you can feel free to DM me if you'd like to to share what happened but oh, you don't need to I don't want you to be uncomfy um so yeah sorry about that I felt like just like lit 10 to 4 uh Lint's like <laughs> we need to go out I was like oh <laughs> okay um so he fed me. So I've eaten now before stream, so that's good. Because I'm really bad at remembering to eat before stream. Um, so yes, I have eaten. I wasn't able to eat everything. I got I got some what did I have? Enchiladas? I think it was enchiladas. Um and I have I hope I don't know if my coffee is gonna be drinkable. Mm hmm I have a mocha. I did some chocolate powder to my coffee. I have gloves on. I have my view mask. I don't have a view master. Got my heat head on. Uh no. I wasn't even up at noon. You're on the phone all day. Oh, toast. Noon. I'm built well. No, because look, noon is when I when Molly starts stream, and that's a very important job. Um. So. So I've been learning a lot about how. Project Zomboid does zombie spawns. And I think that well, the conclusion that we came to last night, Toast, about time is that with the spawn rate that we've got on the server, it's pretty low. So it's going to take, like, the, the population won't hit cap it until 50, day 50. Um, and every time you go into a new cell, it like basically like logs that is the starting point. So if you go in to, yeah, exactly, we've been too quick to explore. So right now we could go into Louisville and it would probably be empty. The problem being, it will stay that way. <laughs> um. So yeah, we've been to efficient, and I think that's the difference. When it was just us before, when it was the two of us, um, we were keeping things pretty close. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I see your message, Stu. 
Um, <coughs> I'll, I'll, thank you. You did? Well, I, I logged in today and dropped a couple of little clumps in, um, on my admin character. I dropped a couple of little, just little bundles in West Point. Just like little, like 10 here and 10 there uh, in West Point and like I can choose where they go. Yeah, it's like cupcake thingies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so we, 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 just a few in West Point. Um, and they, I watched them sort of disperse. Um, so I can, until the population builds up, I can comfortably do that. I'll just wait till you guys aren't online so you don't see where I'm dropping the zombies. Um, not that it matters. Uh, but I did turn on the redistribution. I did turn the redistribution back on. Um, because that's what makes them spread out between the cells. Um, so it, it shouldn't affect our little enclaves. Um, and there is a known bug where zombies still spawn inside safe houses. Um, so there's nothing I can do about that one, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, so I've just been doing a little bit of research here and there. Yeah. Okay. Stu, I, I am interested in the message that you sent me. I'm glad you sent it to me. I'm going to wait until I can actually give it attention. Um, so I'm, when I'm not multi doing too many things at once, so I can actually give it the attention that it deserves. Because I, I feel like that's important. Um, but thank you for sharing that with me. It's always nice to know how your friends are, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I just like, I don't want people to think I'm leaving them on unread. I just like to give things the attention they're due. Um, so, so yeah, so I, I did um, the initial population and also the other thing that we had is the initial population was set to zero. So the way that the multipliers work meant that they were spawning really, really fucking slow. Um, so I changed the initial population of each cell to be one, which is normal. Hi, Amelia. Hello. Um, so basically one on day one, on day two, that would be two on day three. Um, and I, the multiplier is 0.5, I think. Um, so we should start noticing if we're patient. Basically, I have to cool my heels and stop being so so impatient um, and, and wanting to explore. And just let things happen. Um, but yeah, we I may have to manually repopulate uh, West Point and Muldraw. I don't know how far you went through Muldraw, um, but I can... I can fill it in easy enough. And there is a, like I said, there is a respawn timer, so that should help. Um, so, we're on the rampage for the, <laughs> um, okay, well, I'll, maybe I'll do Mel Draw tomorrow. I th I'm just worried that if I fuck around with the settings too often, it's just going to make things really painful. But I'm almost... If it were a single player game, I'd be tempted to just be like, you know what, let's just wipe it and start again. But with there now being like five or six of us, I don't want to do that. 
especially after all the works you put into doing all the fencing. So, yeah, I mean it's all easy enough. I I can I can change things. Um, or let me change scene. I love my new transition. I think it's so cool. Um, yeah. It's easy enough to I can either log in on the admin character or I can do a backend uh, edit on the server. So it's the the only thing I'm wary of is if I like I'm worried that it'll re reset the zombie spawning behavior every time I make a change. But. Once we get figure out where we want, that's okay. Thanks, Amelia. Hey, have you been playing on the, the latest update? Are you playing on 1.19 yet, Amelia? Or are you waiting for it to like release release? Also, I found a 90s playlist for today. So I figured that was appropriate for the game. Okay, Stu. Why? It's so weird. I wish my timers were working. Ooh. Try. Oh. What? What did it break? Oh, look, this is me doing my usual thing. Where I, I sit here staring at the screen when it's literally telling me to click start. Oh no! Alright. Well, that's good to know. Now I've got to walk through all the rooms. Nope! <sighs> I'm really excited for it. I'm I'm very eagerly awaiting for it to like properly drop so that we can all get into it on Drax's server. Very good, darling. Well done. Oh right, I forgot I bought some cardboard boxes home. I bought some boxes home, ma. I only hold ten, but. I know. I'm so excited that you're enjoying playing it. Like every now and then, like I know people play game, like people have bought games because of me playing them and seeing other people play. I'm not going to take full credit. Um, but it's such a neat feeling when something that you really enjoy and then someone else picks it up and the, they also find the same joy in it. Like, that's one of the things that I love about streaming. <laughs> Toast, it's so good. Alright. I wish you could reorder these bags. But yeah, it makes me happy when people are like, I started playing Vintage Story. <laughs> I'm so proud of you, Amelia. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, help. I've fallen and I can't get up. Hmm. I added some hot chocolate powder to my coffee and it's so yummy. How are my cupboards doing here? I have some room in my canned goods. Oh right, they
I just remembered. Yeah, you can change the temperature of the oven. Oh snap, you can set a timer? Here I am cooking everything at 400 degrees. Hey, hey! They're useful, okay? You never know where you might need a cardboard box. You're supposed to be streaming, young man. Have you seen outside? I don't think I need to be reminded. All right. I'm still trying to get my UI the way that I want it. <laughs> yes. Yes. All right. Oh no, not the mayo. Um, see, now I feel guilty that I want to make a meal. We, we, we do have quite the little pile of of boxes outside. Fresh frozen mayo. Hmm. There's nothing in here that's stale, right? Post. Eat a frozen ham. Yummy. Stew. Ham. A hamsicle. Ham pop. Ham pop. Sorry. You all deserve that. All right, what it, like, let's put some of this in here too. Oh, but not all of them. All right. So I think today we're going to try, we're going to try and stay close to home. We're going to stay in Riverside and allow the server to just like do its thing. Um. Good time to let, we're going to like level up some skills. Um. I think maybe I need to work on carpentry so I can get some better shelving in here. Like I really maybe set up some like a a safe house at each end of the zone. Wait, if I slice the ham, can I still use it in the stew? I guess we'll find out. Did I just break my machete by slicing ham? No, I didn't. Okay. That would have been something. All right. Create stew. Oh, you can. Excellent. All right. It was. It would be very tragic. Beef and oh, you know what? That sounds really good. Beef and ham stew.
<laughs> I mean, don't don't feel like you can't go off and and do what you want to do. I don't see it. I guess if if worse comes to worse, we can always just like. Brief refresh things honestly i really enjoy the start of this kind of game the process of like ex ex setting up like finding a base and setting up the basic stuff that you need it's uh the same in like conan and valheim that's my favorite bit Okay, out of curiosity, can I cook? Let's see. No, it won't let me do that. Okay, I was curious. Wait, what? Out where? Is there a clown here? Forest? What have you done? Oh god! Who? What the heck? <laughs> who? Who did that? Who put the clown? Who? Stu, did you put it? <laughs> That's. <laughs> no, thank you. I was like, I just assume all the cheeky things are toast. No, the best thing about the clowns is the the, the balloons. Alright. Hmm. Also, I think I figured out how to actually set the server spawn point to be out from the front of our house. Beforehand. I found out that the last you so you've got like latitude and longitude. Um, and then I found out that the last number is altitude. Um, and I don't know why, but the last time I tried to put it was like 5,000 and something is the altitude number. <laughs> That's fair, Stu. Thank you. Um, so the number I had was 5,000, but basically uh, zero in the last digit means ground floor, one in the last digit means first floor, so on and so forth. So I think I have it so that pe new people spawn or the fixed spawn location is in front of this house. But the best thing about the, the clown costumes, Amelia, is that you get a balloon that you can tie to your backpack and then you can run around with a balloon popping after you. And that's cool. Alright. Alright, there's some there's some stew at my place. Stew's on the counter again. it work you really need to figure out how this mod works uh 
Um, It's it's right right on the tars. It's right on the counter there. do this I was oh you mugged me oh all right <laughs> thanks why am I saying thank you for being mugged oh that's what I needed was the make coffee oh wait wait I'll get there ah here we go Now I'm making coffee. I'm I'm far too entertained by this. All right. Two cups of coffee coming up. burn it A hot cup of coffee glug 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 So there's stew and a cup of coffee on the counter. Uh, I'm gonna put you in the air and you in the air. You in the air. Thank you, Toast. I knew I was. I knew I'd get there eventually. You can have bur they, we've got bourbon. I've got I got bourbon, white and red wine and white wine. <laughs> You're late. Well, I was late too, Drax. <laughs> the other streamer with a new haircut. That's fair. I was late starting by like an hour and a half. Wait. Oh, th oh yes, we're running. I was like, Peach, what? Yeah, so yeah, yeah, we've got authentic Z on there. Oh, nice. You got a military radio, Stu. Good job. Drax, I hope you're well today. And enjoying perhaps not being eaten. 
Look, if you're gonna backseat my kitchen, you can come into the server and you can clean my floor for me, okay? Oh, a chainsaw update. Wait, I've got a mop. I got a bro I got a broom and a bucket. And I'm not afraid to use them when I am. Cleaning's against my religion. Um, I'm good, thank you. I am full of enchiladas. How do you? Oh, you can just like that. Look at that. Look at that. Wait, no, that didn't work. Look, see, I don't know how to clean. It's such a shame. Oh well, never mind. Do I need a bucket? I bet I need a mop or a rag. It's too much effort. See, this is why I don't clean. <laughs> it's like, yeah, that's good. All right, so um, a mop and bleach. Okay. So apparently the problem was yesterday, like we've been having problems with the server feeling not populated enough is we're exploring too fast. And so the cells aren't populating. <laughs> A rag works too? All right. I'll save that for, for Drax. Hi, Ollie. Ravi will be pleased to know. Uh, I don't know what that is, so no. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm guessing. Um, but yeah, so we, like we were going into, we went into a couple of areas yesterday and there were like no zombies. And then I realized because we had a low starting population and I had the modifier quite low. So it's taking a while. Well, it's not, it's not a, a well, now I know what the problem, it, what it is. I know we just have to give it a few days um, to allow the cells to to populate um, but yeah like we went into West Point yesterday and it was pretty much empty um, but I think I accidentally reset all the counters to zero so it's basically treating like three days ago as like day one for zombie spawning I, I know what I'm trying to say, but I don't know if it makes sense. <laughs> Yay! All the buttons. Um, tell me about this zombie, this this fix. Because I, I like things on Care Bear mode, but I still like to be able to boop stuff. And I don't want to have to keep on like manually spawning zombies. The, the buttons are there to be pushed. Well, I know that they will, like, from one cell to another, if you drag them from one cell to another and don't refresh them, like, don't see them, they will vanish. Like, when they're, when they're unseen. Oh man, I am so bored. Right. What, what, one book wasn't enough for you? You need another book? Alright. Okay, Ollie. What are we at here? Everything's looking good there. Okay, that's interesting. I don't know that 
Uh, yeah, like I've I've seen the vanish on my friend's stream. Like they'll just poof. Be gone. You know what? Maybe I could do with a bath. I'm pretty gross. Let's have a, a bit of a wishy wash. Sure. I appreciate you asking. I think I think most of uh, most of the issue though is literally just that they haven't spawned in yet. And so we're going into a new cell where zombies haven't spawned, but because like because nothing spawned there, it's basically like locking the spawn rate is super low. Is that it? Great. Uh, yes. Yes, you can. Thank you again for asking. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, either way, whichever is easiest. Okay. Does it have cliff notes? Gotta wash my crowbar. Gotta wash my machete. And then I wash myself. Yeah, I'm just having it. I've got closed captions on so I can. Oh, okay. That's interesting. Okay. But yeah, that that could definitely be it. But like I said, like a lot of them, I originally had the initial spawn as being zero. Um, so there there wasn't a lot to start with. I had it on like the the easiest, like the lowest population start. So that was, I think, as part of it too. And where the day fifty is the cap. It was on zero, but I've changed it to one. So I think that's why we basically just had like event type ones rather than actual dudes wandering around. Well, I only just changed it to one today. It was at zero. So day 50 was cap. So wait, so yeah, we should have hit that actually. I can't remember what the multiplier is. I think it's like 0. 0.5. Yeah, I saw the, the, the things popping off there. Am I hungry again? Whoopsie. Pyro, what are you sending me? <laughs> okay. Only the server has it installed. No culling, no stale zombies.
I mean, I'm not surprised. The number of like games where players have done effects. Let me see if I can, um, I don't know, Toast, Stu, if you guys want to look at it and if you want me to set that up on the server, we can do that. Uh, no Mo Cullen. It basically stops servers from being purged. Zombies from being purged. Shared. I've known Shared for a couple of years now, and it does sound like it would fix some problems. I'll put it in Discord too. Yeah. Bad <laughs> wouldn't lead me down a garden path. Servers connect via FTP. Oh, you fancy! Once in the server. Wait, what? Why is it so hard to brain when streaming? Right. Uh, browse to zombie pop man. Paste the files. Oh, okay. That looks pretty simple. Oh, population management. Derp. <laughs> it is. I'm trying to like, I'm also mindful that I look like I'm just like Ugh, staring at the screen. Um, okay. Well, I'm, I'm glad, I'm willing to set it up. I just would like, like uh, the other regulars, just to, to confirm that it's okay with them before I chuck it on. Yeah. Bra Brainy is hard. It's probably gonna. Oh no, no, I'm aware of that. I was literally just speaking out loud about how it, the instructions for installing through FTP, which is fine. Uh, it sounded like it was only something that I needed to ins that only needs to be installed on the server. Oh my god, this song is so backstreet, boys. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> I 
I picked a 90s themed playlist for today. I felt like that was appropriate. Perfect. That's some good work there. If the server files a patch, it affects the entire server and the players. If the regular game files a patch, it affects the individual player. So. Alright, good. GitHub link. Where's the GitHub? need the class files right yeah 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 zombie picker and optimizer class file oh look it's fine my computer has been a big baby yeah you're not a troll shed Whoopsie. All right. <sighs> Server. Where is my Java folder though? Oh god. We're trying to make them all zombie-ish. Apparently there's a known thing where basically zombies are getting culled in an effort to preserve the game. Like there's a, a maximum population and funky weird shit's going. So there's a thing that I can do to, to the server. Uh, yes. I th to your second question, yes, I believe. So, but I don't know. I think so, yeah, because it's still August. It does, yes. Where the fuck is the... Oh, there's the Java folder. Java... Zombie. Ba ba ba! Pop man. Pop man! Beep ba 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 da. Maybe I weed on them. Tara, you're doing such a good job. Keep it up. <laughs> okay. Well, I have the files and I can upload them easily. I have... That's small enough. I don't think I can just use the FTP manager. I don't need to use my software, so... Pants! I watered my pants too. I'm a big kid now. I'm a big kid now. Uh, but yes, this is basically a, a patch for the server to make the zombies not disappear and despawn when funky shit happens. Also, I'm eating the last of the stew apparently I'm very hungry. Yeah. But uh, he did also figure out how to spawn spawn zombies too. I have an admin character set up that's separate from this one so I don't get tempted. So I like logged in this morning and popped a little couple of Zombie nuggets on the ground. Ew, that sounds disgusting. Please don't zombies nuggets, no. Sounds terrible. 
Mmm, zombie nuggies. Ugh. I'm so upset. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> uh, yes, I can't remember how to do it. <laughs> uh, exclamation mark, quote, space, add, and then a thing? I don't know. I'm not the one who. Normally it's Echo or Punky that adds them. Or Buckma. <laughs> I don't know how to stream my stream anymore. Apparently I'm too reliant on my mods. Um. Yes, exclamation mark, quote, space, add, and then the quote, and it will add in the the game and the name and everything after that. Yeah. Well, the the one I've got is one that was written for me uh, by a, a very very talented person for streamer bot. Whoopsie. Okay. Oh, now I need to smoke again! Fuck's sake, this smoking thing's addictive, man. Hello? Oh, for fuck's sake, it's because it's favorited. At the moment, I think it is it toast and it's just to it's toast and stew on right now. So. I got kitty ears over my hat, and it's amazing. Toast, do you have a balloon already? Good old pop pop. Toast, do you want to? Do you want this purple balloon? Balloon. Oh god, I'm stuck dancing. Okay, here we go. Yes! I've basically won the game now. I haven't done a sweep of the area yet today, so... Oh hey, your plants are sprouting! Balloon. That's great. It means if I get lost at the fairground, you guys can find me. Seventy-five degrees. I guess it makes sense that I'm overheating. Oh. Are there different stages? I haven't done the farming, so I don't know how it works. Yeah, last time watered 56 hours. I mean, it says it's okay. Yeah. It says it's well watered and flourishing. Are you also well watered and flourishing, Pyro? Can we get you anything? Old man. Alright, what am I doing today then? <laughs> My very fancy map markers. Ooh, actually, let's go check out that house. 
The raid box. I wait. Where did my purple go? Oh, there's my purple go. You need some dirty magazines. Oh, lamppost. It's f oh god. This does not drive the same as the truck. These buildings look fucked up already. That's so great! That'll cheer you up, Pyro. Just go look, hunting for undies. Oh, wait, wait. I was sworn I saw something in there. Nothing says fun like Andy's. I could have sworn I saw something in there. No, oh, stop it. Don't do that. Ah, oh. we have some neighbors no stop that can we and never figure out where I want no oh. is there a, a door This is fine. How many? Oh, there's only a few in here. Hey, you guys! Do you like my balloon? You got a little something stuck in your uh, in your neck there, buddy. That was squishy. I don't think I can hear anything else. Also, I'd just like to say thank you to Blue Fang for sponsoring our server. You're cool and awesome, and I, I, I like your. goes back to there. <gasps> Mop! Do I need bleach? I'm gonna take the bleach anyway. 
I'm gonna have to get a mop for when Drax joins. I mean, like that's that's not gonna happen, but you never know. One day. One day. Aww, sadness. Mmm, I could make you some dead rat stew. Oh, we have ads popping in 30 seconds. Uh, so this would be a great time to stand up and stretch. Take a break. Do a move. Uh, eat all of the melted ice cream before it goes off. I'm going to try and do better today about taking breaks during ads. Um, so you need to get your car... Where did I park? Your car backed up to the trailer, but not touching, but very, very close to the trailer hitch. And then you stand near it and hit uh, V for vehicle um and there should be like a little plus symbol and if you mouse over it it'll say thanks what for giving me that twice it'll say like attach x to y hello Alright, I am going to do what I said and take a quick bio break. This is my car. And I will be back in a couple of minutes. You guys should take a break too and I'll see you soon. It was a good way. A certain somebody has been a brat today. Someone who happens to be streaming 
in the room next to me decided to take the piss out of me talking about boxes. So when I opened my door today, I just then, I posted a picture in Discord. The gallery, so you can see what he did. Did you get the trailer figured out? Oh, you did? Oh my god, they suck. Reversing in this is so hard. I mean, obviously, you're probably, like, really good at it. Oh, this is pretty close to my house. I'm just going to park in the neighbor's yard. It'll be fine. Yeah, parking is fine. But the, I was going to say unparking it? No, that's not a word, doll. Unparking it's tricky. Unparking. Oh my god, my nose is so fucking itchy. Hi, Bane! Anyway, so I restacked the boxes outside his door. So we, we'll see if that escalates. Um, you can use that same method, Pyro, if you want to tow a car out of the road. Like, if you've got a, a wrecked car or a car that won't, st that you can't get into a start, you can attach your car to it and then tow it off the road. This is my digital watch, my bag of digital watches. Glasses, gloves. Why is it so dark? Start dressing boxes that would be cute. Oh, wait, I have that. My favorite thing is I know he's waiting to get a reaction out of me for it. Perfect. Dull smash. How is my carpentry so high? Must have just been from videos, I guess.
You got kicked for laying on the bed? What? UI policy 12, type 12. You got, ex excuse me, so under policy type 12, I'm going to have to kick you from the server. How do you lay down? Um, I can prevent that from happening if it does again. I don't know what they are, but I know I can disable the policy kicks. <laughs> oh you did it again okay let me uh hop over and fix that okay Well, no, but it's something that other people are going to encounter as well. So, I'd rather fix it while I can. I'll just log into my invisible admin character. Apparently, there was a record of me duping some cheese yesterday. Well, that's not fucking... Hang on a second. This is not a creepy sight at all. I load in and there's just, like, a clown standing there. Um, yeah, like Hex. Wait, no, not that one. This one? No. Yeah, look at this. I, I attempted... I duped some processed cheese. I'm a thief and a hacker. No, it didn't. Cr it was only one piece of cheese. Yeah. Okay, so it looks like we need. I've just. I'm pretty. Sh I'm pretty sure I disabled twenty two. But just to double check. <laughs> so five. 12 and 22. Uh, is it in this? No, it's in the server options. Okay. I don't know if the server needs to be rebooted for that to take, um, but that should should help that at least. Sure. 
I mean, if we got it, if we if we have to do a server reset, I can upload that uh, zombie fix too. At the same time, if it's okay with everyone, it just, just stops. You are a successful potato. Excellent. Good job being a potato. Toasted potato. Potato toast. Ta toast from potato bread. Hmm. Roasty tots. Okay, fire. You should be able to sleep now then. I can edit some of those things in the console, but honestly, it's easier to do it on the admin character where you've got like the, the graphic interface. Hey Ma, it is, thank you. Doing good. Oh, hey, thank you. Listen. I almost did. Thanks, Ma. Very kind. Flynn's gonna have to work extra hard if he wants to touch my biddies. Don't you worry about that. He tried to box me into my room. I said what I said. Yep. Yeah. I'm such a lucky lady. You better bloody love mine. Oh, I don't care. I ain't worried about that. Oh, this item, whoopsie. I've tried that, doesn't make any difference. Too heavy for inventory. Oh, wait, what? Okay, fine. Thank you. All right, enjoy torturing my husband. Now I finally remembered how to like move furniture.
Or at least I thought I did. Oh, wait. It's gotta be in your primary inventory, Del. Fuck's sake. Hello. Aha. There we go. I'm good, thank you. Oh, just like that. Made werewolves still don't know. What is it that you're not sure of? We now have werewolves and vampires uh, as options for Sims Big Bother. Uh, so you can uh, when you when you join the Big Bother thing next week, if you're a sub, uh, you can. Uh, there's all sorts of options now, so you can be uh, if not is it fairy? I can't remember what the term is. But there's basically now four options. You can be an alien, uh, a, a spellcaster, a werewolf, or a vampire. Am I still over encumbered? I am. Oh, because I've still got planks on me, for fuck's sake. It doesn't matter. If it makes you happy, it's all that matters. I'm, I'm not concerned about things being law friendly. Not in the slightest. Oh, I didn't want to move you. I really need to learn how to use... I got this mod for helping organize storage and I need to figure it out. I accidentally made soup instead of stew again. He didn't try and trap me, but um, this is what I saw when I opened my door. Are you surprised? Because he was picking on me for hoarding boxes in game and made some smart ass comment about how many boxes we have in the house. I, for a minute, I opened the door and I thought maybe I had a bunch of birthday presents because it's my birthday on Wednesday. And then I realized it was just him being a dick. 
And my little heart broke. I mean, it didn't, but I'm a tell it did. You picked up the floor book, Starst? Nice. I thought I thought I was getting a treat. <laughs> I was like, <gasps> birthday presents for me? Oh, never mind. Old boxes. Yay. I mean, I am cat. <laughs> Moore's giving him shit. Love it. All right, we have a generic meat and lentil soup. With, ooh, you know what? This could be okay. It's like ham, I've made, I've made ham and bean soup. Host is like, I'm here for soup. Hey, I heard there was soup. Is there soup? I like soup. Ooh, that's a good spin. You make curry. I don't know if you can make curry. <laughs> Ooh, toast you fancy. There's a lot of stuff you can make. What I so Flint is trying to talk shit, and the great thing is, I've got his stream up on my other screen. I can read his closed captions. Well, actually, as it turns out, Toes, there's a server issue. Um. Which could be preventing some some zombie issues, some zombie problems. <laughs> oh god. What do you mean? I am hardcore. What are you talking about? There's some soup on the counter. But the problem is, there's a bug in the game which I have to patch so that we can get zombies. Also, well, apparently I'm just wandering around with a lime in my bag. Some of my favorite- oh my god, Ma, it's fine. Honestly, I don't. I don't have any expectations. Um, it's there's like a few people on the server right now. Or, but no, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. No, it's fine. I, I I have to like remind him repeatedly. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's pro I'll probably just wait until everyone's logged out. We get some stoop. But that's okay. So there's there's two different factors in play with the zombie population. Um, one is that it takes a couple of months for the population to build up. 
um there's like a, a starting population and then a multiplier each day um so there's that and we've not been on the server for long so basically the population hasn't built up and the other is potentially the the fact that there's a soft cap on the number of zombies that can spawn in multiplayer and that's what the patch fixes Hello, Moore is really trying in Flint's chat to try and convince him to do something for me. It's hilarious. Okay, and very sweet. All right, let's see if I've got any other shelves in here that I can bring down. Whoopsie. Uh, yes, to a certain degree, yes. So you can choose your your starting level of zombies. So basically, how many zombies were spawned per chunk of the game? Um, and there's a scale, and then you can alter the multiplier. So how many times that pops in on each day and then you can alter the cap so if it stops spawning on like day 30 for instance rather than day 50 then you get a lower number of zombies well not lower number but just less days of multiplying um no not really just flint being a flint um, and then you can also change the type of zombies that you have in game um and the environmental awareness of them so you can have them where they just like mindless zombies or you can have them where they are they have some sort of intelligence and where they can hear better and see better and have more yeah like there's a lot of granularity that you can edit in this game uh no mine mine is a hundred percent like i've i've dialed it back I think pretty significantly so one of the other the the initial server settings that you can choose is whether you start um like the day that the world ends basically or you can set it to be like 60 days after or like a year after and obviously a year after the apocalypse hits everything's a lot harder so i've kind of Wanting, I wanted it to be comfortable for me to play and stream and goof around. Um, though I have things like l bumped up a little bit from like the easiest mode, but not a great deal, but just like a little bit. Ah! <laughs> Thanks! Thank you. I'm sorry I couldn't give you information. I'm not very good at saying what I want. <laughs> Thank you. Um, oh no, we definitely, well the thing is, as the game goes on, it will get busier and there's areas on the map that are like really going to be heavily populated so this is the entire map it's fucking huge so this up here is louisville and it is by the time we get up there it's going to be very densely populated so yeah it, it gets pretty full-on even on the lower settings um but you can you can dial it up um even just by patching the server though like shad said that it'll it'll increase pushback from the game where did that go here wait oh wait no i don't want that there what do i
So, but one of the things we also need to do is just like stay out of like the... We've, we've spread really far. Um, so we just kind of need to give everything a f chance to finish cooking, I guess. And so I've got a bunch of stuff all over the place, so I'm just trying to organize things a bit so I don't have to climb all over. Really irritated that I just assembled that actually. I'm, I'm able to do a lot more than I thought I could actually. My character's like, oh my god, I am so bored. Please, can we do something else? What? Oh god. Oh, that could have ended badly. Wait, where's my bathroom? Down here. Is that all I've got there? No, not there. Here. Need to... Wait, where did they all go? Where did they all go? I thought I had more stuff in there. Oh, right. I did. I guess I need somewhere to put ammo as well. Guns. Not gonna use them, but. I forgot how heavy these things are. This inventory system is something. Oh, I should pop you in the air. My poor character. Hey, I'm getting exercise though, so that's something. Right. Just can't remember where I was putting shit. So much of this game is inventory management. Thanks for popping in. 
we doing in here? It's a nice little bathroom. Oh, I wonder if I can... Make them better. Floor, but not the can- oh. It is a really cute game. Wait, wait. It does not have an item on the surface. What? Oh, the sink, for fuck's sake. <sighs> like, there is, there is more to it than what I'm doing. I just, everything I do, I don't do anything quick. Everything is slow mode. Yes. Wait, those hold 20. What does that hold? Oh, that's the same thing. Characters is like, oh, why are you making me do this? I, I, I am mildly tempted to just go out. I kind of wish if you had, if you were beating zombies up with a saxophone, that it would make the noise or make a noise, like Vintage Story. It would just start tooting. Oh, that was loud. Um. Oh God. <laughs> You're so vibrant. Stop. Oh, did one half break? Fuck, I think it did. Yeah, it's alright, you get used to it after a while. Oh, you emptied the trash too? Between Post and Flint, putting things outside my door. this fucking thing. I care about that.
Boil a piper. Okay, now, there we go. Now I'm fine. Yeah, basically I've got a bunch of shit organized into like boxes and it's driving me bonkers. So. I don't think that's going to fit there, is it? I'm, I'm so tired of being hungry all the time. Though I do enjoy the cooking. I think it's pretty fun. Beef stew. Delicious. This reminds me of a vintage story how like you can't leave food alone or it will burn. I think I already have two beef in there, but oh well. Yeah. Beef and beans. I kind of love the, um, how you can kind of have a play with the recipes. Someone drank all my coffee. Awkward bubbling sounds. What time is it? 3.40. You know what? It's fine. I should just go out and get some more stuff. I need to check the other houses for shelves. And I want to get some clothing racks as well. Because <laughs> once I figure if I can get this place set up, and I'm pretty sure I've set it so that new people spawn in front of this house, and they can just come in here, get what they need to set off, and then go off on their own merry little way. 
and then I can then figure out where I want to hang out. Mmm, delicious. They should fill me up real good. Alright. There's a non bearded stew on the counter. I wish I'd put that in the bathroom, actually. I see what's across the road. So I guess actually I should probably go outside of the community so that people don't have completely empty houses if they want to stay in this area. other side you would think after 14 years hi Ravi um that I would know to which side of the car to get into Apparently, I don't. I do have a balloon now. I'm I'm pretty excited about that, to be honest. Oh, hey, I should raid. Out. I should see if there's anything worthwhile raiding in here. <laughs> balloons, yeah, cause it's my birthday month. That's why I need balloons. I should probably have my weapon out. <laughs> Balloons, yeah. I, I don't think I need a paper towel dispenser. dispenser. I definitely don't need a urinal. Oh yeah, I didn't check these bodies. A lot of furniture in here. These function as storage. They don't. They're just decoration. Ooh. I don't think I want those. I'm not using the trailer today. I'm just using my little my little runaround car. Isn't it great? Oh, here we go. Wait, there's gonna be some shopping in here. Whoopsie. That's it. There's no reason to not look fabulous even during the apocalypse. Also, I'd like to point out I have kitty ears as well and a bow
Which which ones do I want? I think you want these ones. Well. A fail, yeah. Everything's a hundred percent off. Great deal. Those hold fifth. It holds a fair amount of weight. Oh, Jesus Christ, it's terrifying sound. I only got half of it. Oh. doing today, Ravi? No, oh, there's not much. How much inventory space in this car? There's still the seats. Oh, yeah, that's right. Wait, do those count? that I'm jumpy. Shelves breaking. Oh, no, it's just that the shelves think they're too good for themselves. Oh, look, double errors up. But there are also like random undead environmental sounds. So. These bookshelves think they're all that in a bag of chips, and they're not. that this plate the map is so huge like it's fine but 
like the the chances of of us all sticking around here it i wouldn't worry about it like I, I came out here rather than breaking down the shops, uh, breaking down furniture in the houses near where we, we are. But it doesn't matter. Everything can be built. My, my only concern is just that, you know, like, I, and I don't think it's a problem with any front, anyone from here is, is just that in previous games where I've played where people have just been inclined to interfere with stuff. So. As I said, I had, I had a Minecraft server where there was someone who was just constantly like helping decorate other people's houses and it just pissed everyone off. Um, but I don't think anyone here is really likely to do that, so. And even if you fail, it doesn't matter. Yeah. I mean, I I will accept all flamingos. <laughs> Hi Molly! I will gladly accept any flamingo offerings that, that you that you feel like I need. I will never say no to flamingos. Also, we have ads popping in 30 seconds. Maybe. Possibly. Did it work? It did. Oh, no, the ads are now. Oh, it's so heavy. Uh. Okay, this should do. I'm just trying to get some shelves on this house. Um. So unless I, I hear otherwise, I'm probably going to do that server fix um, tomorrow before stream. Um, that will stop zombies from like disappearing. And uh, that should make things a bit more interesting. Oh. Why are you in the middle of the road? I could have sworn I towed you off the road. I don't know if you can paint those. I have no idea if you can paint flamingos. Oh. Can you please find Dell some flamingos? <laughs> Thanks, Molly. Oh, come on, little guy. You can do it. There we go. That'll do. <laughs> Thank you for ten. Oh, man. Ten tears. So good. I, I have to ask, what is it? With watching Twilight Zone on New Year's, is that like a tradition that I missed somehow? Because I noticed a bunch of people mention it and I'm curious. Oh, well, that's really cute. All right, I'm, I, someone just discovered their headlights. 
No. What? And the steering wheel as well, apparently. Oh, okay. Did I? Oh, bloody hell. I missed the turn, didn't I? Oh, now I do need the lights. All right, welcome. Welcome back from ads. I did a real good job of taking a break and you can't prove otherwise. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, it, I noticed a few people talk about it as the like New Year's Eve thing, and I was like, interesting, because. Whoop. One of those things, I guess, just we, did, we didn't have in New Zealand. Back in my day. Well, back in Pop Pop's day. Mm. Like, man, it is really. Oh, that's a hedge. It's fine. Is it gonna let me do it? Oh, it is. Oh, God. What? Thomas? What is this? What the heck? Every time I come by, it's doing something different. <laughs> hey, well, if that doesn't put off the zombies, I don't know what will. Excuse me. And I like those are cool. It's it's kind of it's cool, but I don't I don't know if if I want that. Okay, that's all I've got there, right? Yeah. So 
So I've got a bit of storage. I can put shelves under here as well. I know that that's very particularly very um, useful storage size. Well, those each hold 50. Those hold 30. Those only hold 25. Wait, that's 50 each as well. Okay. How much does a bookshelf? That's 40. I wonder if I can do this. Yes. Perfect. All right, so we've got this. And Oh no! <laughs> it's so easy to do though. So, so easy to do. And then you look at your feet and you're surrounded. I do like that the shelf changes appearance. Perfect. They were still in your pack? <laughs> I wish I understood how this worked. Wait, wait. No, don't turn that off. Oh. Yeah, you can. A hundred percent. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh my God, this is amazing. I think I've just figured out a thing. So I've got a... Actually, it's not going to work here. I've got a, a, a mod on here for organizing containers and I was like, Ugh! But I think I may have figured it out. I have no idea what I just picked up. I want toast! <laughs> what? Why did you put it in front of the door? It's a toast! There's a toaster! in front of my door and apparently that means I can't walk out of my front door 
I've been toasted. This is this is why we can't have nice things. Also, it's kind of cool. Wait, why can't I pick it up? The toaster is blocking me. <laughs> I've been toast blocked. Okay, <laughs> settings. Has anyone told you that you're a brat? Asking for a friend. <laughs> I couldn't hear over your laughter. Oh, God. Look, don't you make me, don't you make me pull the server over. All right, so there are a bunch of hats over here. Oh shit, I still have clothes in my car. Hey. Oh, oh, I still have. Another shelving, shelving thing. In this game, you can walk through barricades, you can walk through shrubs, but you can't step over a toaster. I can't remember what that looks like. Well, now we know. We have we have uh, done a science, and now we understand the vagaries of toasters. We're basically, uh, I was gonna say, we're not doing a Marie Kondo, but we're, we're doing a, a hoarders organization stream today. 
Because it's drawing me nuts how disorganized this is. <sighs> I need to go through and check the quality on these, but... I love how these shells populate. Oh, that's nice that you can walk through that. I like that a lot, actually. Okay, so now we want to make sure all of these are actually in good condition. And anything that's not in good condition, I'm going to turn into rags. Oh, Pyro, I've got... Wait, I don't know if you're on. There's overalls in here. No, Pyro's not on anymore. I think I have a system here that's going to work. Possibly. Here's a good test. Okay. Configure container. Clothing body. Second, if I assign that to be clothing leg, do I have any legs clothes? So it didn't quite work like that. Oh, that's full already. All right. Let's make that clothing head. Oh, 
Honestly, that is still kind of handy. Figure. We're gonna make that accessory. And what? And feet. understand how it works. I don't think it wanted to It's not really any faster than this, but I imagine if you're standing in a room full of lots of storage containers, this will help a lot. I'm kind of digging this 90s playlist. Got little like sort of vibes of like a little bit of like sound garden kind of thing, and a little bit of like in sync sort of backstreet boys every now and then. Oh, we did put everything in there. get some organization going here. Right. That's fine. That's fine. Let's smoke that. I'm tempted to put a box like right here where this rope is just for pyro stuff. Like one of those little wooden crates. I think I have some planks actually. but I'm not going to do that now. All right. And what have I got over here? Maps. And literature. tools.
Alright, there we go. Got all that cleared out, right? Oh, actually, you know, I'm gonna leave those in the air. materials to make a box for a pyro. See, that's where that could come in handy. So now we need, oh, I need to read something. And then we gotta go through and look at those clothes and anything that's not at full. Um, full condition, I'm gonna tear up. apparently I need to eat again this is like vintage story just like non non-stop eating Sometimes it's trying to add food from the freezer. sound scares me more than the jump scare sound.
need some more of this overcoat. Yeah, there's been a couple of times where it, the sound has popped and it's like... I I know there's a zombie there. I've already seen it. Thank, thanks. Thanks for that. Yeah, I don't I don't need to keep it there. So if there's some way that works better then go for it. Did I miss something? <laughs> no, I get it. <laughs> Very cute. You put the fertilizer in the toilet. All right, there's stew on the counter of the unbearded variety. writing and entertainment. Why am I just uncomfortable? Minor damage, please. It's just because I'm getting overweight again. You wouldn't think five nails would take up that much space. Alright. Skirts, are they really going to be particularly useful? Like, really? I, I feel like skirts can probably just get muted here.
You made a cup of tea? Nice. <laughs> I kind of love that you can do that. I didn't finish I didn't finish all my dinner. My lunch, I only ate like half of my lunch. But now I'm like mildly takeish again. Right, so that's 10. It's 15. I don't know if that's where I want those. Oh, wait. Am I seeing things? Oh, right here. You're gonna be spending all your time uh, changing changing outfits. Though I do appreciate the safety goggles. Safety is very important. Safety is no clowning matter. It's very very important. Still don't know if I want. Hello. All right, what have I got in here? All right, making more casserole. How are you today, Nizio? I um I saw your your uh tinfoil armor. It was very cute. You did a good job with that.
Why am I standing over the air? That's weird. Create stew. Honestly, I'm all about the stews right now. These all actually sound really good too. No, I mean, vegan stew could still taste good. Have you tried one? I know you basically live permanently and, and thrive on steak. But you'd be surprised. Yeah, I, I know how how you cream of bacon soup is not vegan. <laughs> I I'm omnivorous. I enjoy lots of things, but I bet I could make a fucking delicious vegan stew. Or like a really good like curry. Easily. We don't eat meat for every meal because it's so fucking expensive. But hi Stone, how you doing? I kind of love my purple balloon. I'm good, thank you. Eagerly awaiting the next winter story update, but also enjoying some projects on board. And contemplating going up and getting more coffee. I think I might in the next air break. Someone would remind me when the ads pop to go get coffee, I would appreciate it because I keep forgetting. I, I feel like a lot of the time when people don't enjoy this game is because they, they've not had a chance to, to mess with the settings. Like it doesn't have to be a really, really hard game. Though I understand that it's not going to appear like Everyone isn't gonna like it, and that's like totally fine. Like for Flint said, the inventory management is just it drives him nuts, and that's fine, obviously. Um, but I absolutely love picking things up and putting them down, and if I can do that and do zombie buffing at the same time, perfect. So what I'm working on at the moment is is basically setting up a, a starting house for new people joining the server. These shelves are a little misleading because this shelf has shoes, but it looks like food almost. I feel like I need to move this. I'm 
what's in here? Eat stuff. It's pretty good. We this this server will be running all year for subs. So if you decide that you fancy playing it with other people, the server will be around. And I do have it on pretty relaxed settings. Because I get too distracted to play. Full on hardcore. Oh, there you go. Where did my hair curlers go? <laughs> I've lost my hair curlers! Oh wait, I think... Never mind. Oh, I've got to get rid of that wall. I need a... Oh, there we go. I need to hire someone with a sledgehammer to come and take out some walls here. Like this, this little corner wall here, it needs to go. I keep walking into it. And the hutch is cute, but I feel like that's got to go too. Those can go in here. Yeah, no, I'm beginning to like this mod more and more, actually. Just don't know where I want to put that. Oh, it broke? Wow, that's problem solved, I guess. Wait, is that my can opener? That is my can opener. We've got some organization going. I think I'm going to try and move that hutch actually. The china cabinet. Oops. 
it breaks, it breaks. It broke. <laughs> That's fine. All right. Things are getting a little easier to navigate now. Apparently we are still chugging on the weight. All right, so we need to go get some stuff. Where do we want to go? Oh god, that scared the crap out of me. A cane just fell over. But like really slowly, so I just saw it sort of tip in the corner of my eye. Weird. All of a sudden, there's flamingos in my backyard, in my front yard. I updated it. Appreciate your caps. Oh, it's too late. You're committed now. All right. Are oh, you dead? Good job. So, are you making an another one then? Jesus, this thing can shift. Oh, you know what? Let's. Oh, that's an interesting looking trailer. Yeah, I hear you, buddy. Wait, where is my machete? All right, crowbar it is. But, 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 but. Blah, 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 blah. Ah, shit, you know what I just did? I said that at my next break, I was gonna get some glasses. Wow, he got nailed. He got nailed so hard. He's nailed in his pockets. I should take those. Hello? I'm gonna take his undies too. <laughs> Don't ask. This trailer holds 468. What the fuck? It's huge. All right. I know I've only just left. I have to go back. Um, 
because I I need to take my ad I need to take a break and get coffee. Um, because I'm re yeah, I think so. But also, I I really need to be better about taking breaks. This is a hard game to just stop. You can't just stop in the middle of nowhere. Because even if you stop in a car, you could get attacked. So I keep putting off taking um, little little breaks when my ads pop up, and I need to get, I need to be better about that. So we're gonna. The only problem is we with a large trailer. Um, you have if you you load it, you gotta unload it. Hey, maybe don't do that. All right, I'm gonna take my break now. Um. You guys should all take a break, stand up, stretch, get a coffee, have a wee, all that good stuff, and I'll see you in a couple of minutes.
swear, every time I go AFK. I like your artwork, Tars. Good job. Oh. Okay. I'm assuming you can't just push these back. All right. I can't resist the allure of that, that big ass trailer. Oh, God damn it. Look, you physics at me. trailer I completely forgot that I'd put the boxes outside of Flint's room so when I went to go to the loop before I was like what is all that <laughs> wait where was it was it at, the, at this junction or the next one the next one yeah it was up here You know what? I'm gonna... I'm not gonna do that now while it's dark. Oh, we're having a pool party? Hey, you guys. Oh, hey, it's a fish, a swimming pool. It's a bad angle. It's moving a little faster than I was expecting. vague hope that I might be able to like put my cigarettes on a quick slot I see you Nice to 
I hope you feel better tomorrow. the sound effects. Oh, what have you got? more significant than a red knife. For a minute there I was hopeful. really dumb place to try and clear it at night. No, I can't remember what I'm curious about. It's fine. Um, no, I'm curious if if claiming a safe house at a hotel would be like one room or the whole fucking hotel. <laughs> Sentences that I was never expecting from you. I love that. That's a tough call. Machine. 
paper. Oops. No, I'll go back through after. I still want, don't want to make sure I don't get any nasty surprises. This is a nice old place. Ooh, this one fancy. That's tough to make gross. Audio cues help so much in this game. We still have the bottom level to clear, but conveniently the sun's coming up, so it's going to help a bunch. hopeful that a random one will have like a a weapon on them that I like. I love my balloon. Actually, the other bo bonus with having the balloons is uh, if you do get turned into a zombie, you can find your body easier. storage room oh 
Oh. I think part of it is that the some of the filters are too yeah I could have sworn there used to be a setting that would let you apply like one hairstyle to all things but I can't remember what it is someone was in that room but yeah there used to be a like a checkbox that would be like apply hairstyles to to all yeah uh, maybe I don't know maybe it moved or something I didn't I didn't think to check to be honest Where the fuck is the light switch in here? Oh well. Room number two. Maybe hit up hit up the old Google and see if there's uh, something there. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. This is a cute truck. Clip me in. It's offensive that I can't break into these vehicles. Just like that. Oh. Hey, you function.
<laughs> exactly. What's it in? Eh, not too bad. I like leaving them hot wired when they're functional and then you just like leave them on the side of the road in case you need to like, I don't know, get away fast or something. A feeling Flint has probably forgotten that I have loaded up a pile of boxes outside his door. Down by the riverside. I need to keep an eye, a, a, eye on the condition of my uh, crew back here. Spotty wins. Really, none in the trees? Going into the trees is too scary. I don't like it. And it's not scary because of the zombies. It's scary because of the trees. You look at a tree wrong and it'll fuck you up. road along here is pretty actually this would be a nice place to build if you cleared away all the uh whoopsie cleared away the uh the trees here pretty got a nice road the trees won't grow on Oh, it's the bait shop. All right. I think this has been visited by a few people. Oh, what keys are it? Hey, 
keys. They don't need no stinking keys. Oh, they didn't do it up. Oh, did it bump that up? 25. give you a level up a skill up anywhere oh well I'm still gonna hotwire all the cars because I feel cool well if it'll let me in I wish you could like paint them or put some marker on them to like I don't know, make it clear which ones are good to go. Where am I? Oh, I'm miles away. Perfect. I don't think there's anything going to be anything left here. I think a couple of you will let it come through, but... Okay. I am going to take those. I want these too. That's fine. car off the road.
Death Beater. Actually, that's something. Uh, whoopsie. I got forwards and backwards confused. Like, go along those main roads and clear the, uh, the road wrecks. I don't know if we've been up here. Um, since all the... Ooh, well, there's someone in there. Hey, dude! How you doing? Good to see ya! I recognize that house. I am, thank you! This would be a really lovely place to build. You've got a road already. All right. Oh wait, hang on a second. Just re realized I don't have. Yeah. Hey, buddy! Don't mind if I do. Honestly, I think I might just do food as well. What you been up to? Oh, newspaper. I went there too. That key go? That goes on here, right? Hey, this isn't a bad little truck car. A full, almost a full tank. That's a pretty awesome station wagon. Ooh, snap. That's not bad. It was an idea. I was kind of hoping I could... Wait, why have I got those? So I don't know where my machete went. that off the road too. Oh, I did looking in the wrong place. Oh, 
Sure, I'll eat those. Yum. Cherries. Right, they don't do anything in the yard there. I'm gonna pull this car off the road. Rude. Why, thanks, don't mind if I do. Still fresh. Mmm, juice box. All right, somewhere in here. You know what? I'm just gonna make. Where is it? Here. No. Oh, well. It's hold. All you have is a microwave. Which is fine. Oh, wait. Oh, but the closet. <gasps> All right, yeah, let me get my truck. I think I can hear someone else out here. Um, define good. I think toast and stew both have pretty good carpentry. Um, mine's almost six. Oh. What you need? It's toast. Hey, I don't remember if this house had a bowl in it. Oh, yep, yep, yep. Yeah, 
guess that one's probably okay there. Peaches, 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 peaches. That's a lot of flamingos. At least this place has an oven. All right, let's do this. I'm gonna cre create a stew. Did it go? All right. Avocado stew. That's fine. It'll do for now. Avocados, carrots, and broccoli stew. Blasted wine glasses that are why are they in there? I just realized, I'm like, man, it's really quiet. Why is it so quiet? Well, Del. Mmm, stew. Yeah, 
There we go, now I'm nice and full. Oh wait, it's doing the wrong thing. So tomorrow is Saturday, which means potentially trucks. Hardwire all the cars. Ah, all right. I thought I could hear something, but I guess not. Cabbage. That's pretty amazing. Oh, a frozen cupcake. Oh, yeah, I want that actually. A, uh, a wooden crate in my place that's uh, got your name on it Pyro like unofficially it's it's the crate for pop cup they grew pretty fast Hello, that sounds pretty good. I feel like I ought to be able to do what you can in Cyberpunk where you can just like whistle and your car comes to where you are. That would be amazing. Look. I don't know what to tell you. Just helping a friend out. Jeez. Fine, I won't. I was going to label it and everything, but never mind. Oh shit. Wait, hang on a sec. Give it dark, give it back. Ooh, 
that's a good flashlight. You see what? What? Oh, you're talking about toast. Oh, whoops. It's popping in thirty seconds. Honestly, this is a cute little place. Grill brush? Oh, oh, fresh banana. Fuck yeah. That was gnarly. Note to self, don't. Don't have earbuds in when your character eats a banana. That's awful. Salad with sunflower seeds. No, I just thought of a way to discern like balked cars from not balked cars. Like you could put cars that are still good with their noses facing to the road and like janky cars like perpendicular to the road, maybe? I don't know. Oh, shit. I don't even think about that. Holy crap, this flashlight is insane. Flashlight's brighter than the headlights. And we're back from ads. Yeah, which apparently I ignored again.
It's just this, I was, I was fully expecting this place to be alarmed. I think I did that one already. Grabbing all the book books for boredom. Books for boredom. It's so dark. What off place? Hey, that's a cute little car. so dark in here.
Ooh. Hey, Kyle. Hey. Just stuffed myself with ice cream. Yeah, look, <laughs> my weight's getting up there again. This is what happens when I go exploring. I eat everything. Oh wait, I wanted to check that car. Oh, it's empty. Today, can hey, back in there. Oh, no, this is really cute. Yes, yeah, yeah. Watches are accurate. That's why um, they're so useful. Especially the digital ones, because it'll keep you keep your prize of time, temperature, and date. Oh, so, yeah. Very handy. Exciting news! Hopefully with less training of other people now. Good. It seems like you just kind of got had that dumped on you when you started that current place, so... Oh. Well, shit. Well, I hope you uh, enjoy the new place a lot better. Wait, what? That... <laughs> That's so dumb. <laughs> yeah, good good job, Pop Pop Farmer. Oh, is this the church? Yeah, this is the church. That's amazing. That's a really good sign. Like, they'll, they're gonna look after you. That's wonderful news. Oopsie. Oop, I've already been up here. Kind of did the whipper in here. You can do it. I believe in you. Really didn't expect to go out, come out this far. What did I... 
What? What am I stuck on? Excuse me. Oh man. I gotta get a a mute button on my mouse so that you guys don't have to hear me sneeze. I think I just did a big squiggle there. <laughs> nope, that's not the way I want to go. <laughs> oh god, I'm drunk. That's fine. Okay, so this meets up here. I'm pretty sure Ali was down here for a while. Keep an eye on my gas here. Hi, Luna. I'm good, thank you. How you doing? no light in here. Yay! That sounds very good. All right, get some more fertilizer. Fertilizer for for Pyro's garden. There's a house over there. Oh, hello. Why are my lights not working? headlights oh wait no something was bugged there hey no yeah I must have broken my headlights wait now they turn on what the heck?
That's amazing. Good job. Oh good, light stain to come up here. Yeah, there's... Um... Settings that I feel are kind of important to, to make it comfy. going on this is weird I mean but getting your face eaten off is part of the the charm I guess My, I've lost the rose. This is a, such a pretty little house. But none of these bodies look like toast. It's a pretty house. Oh, 
Oh, that could be. Hi, Brickley. That's a toast. I think I found a corpse of toast. I did. This is a nice- I like this house. This is a nice house. Oh, thank you. It's- I'm so posh. And I think the, the kitty is really just like pull the whole outfit together. bit of a loot gremlin right now but that's okay oh I can't remember what they came from cooking pot in whoop oh god is there a cooking pot in here oh it was a roasting pan okay We're having roast steak for, for a snack. <laughs> Guess that'll be like a prime rib. Very high in protein. Gonna be shitting bricks for, for a couple of days after this. It's the shit. Oh, is that what it is, hobbits?
do your butt a solid so your butt can do a solid for you. Somehow, in the zombie apocalypse... I'm... Uh, obese and a chain smoker. Oh, hey, why is that on the ground? Wait, wait, what was this? Aha! Uh -huh. Oh shit, this thing sta started up straight away. This jar is real nice. I love these garden patches. Look at this. Just a scarecrow, it's just creepy looking. like cute little bond bits oh I need to put the key back in there Back up, please. Generators.
What's that sound? Oh, it's just... Just stuff. Oh, one second. I was like, what is all this stuff that I have on me? It's a bunch of stuff of of posty corpse. Do it again. All right, so this is where I came into this place. The barn. Wait, is that even use? It's not useful for anything. It's just decoration. I feel like standing in a bar full of straw is probably a barn full of straw is probably not like a great place to smoke. It's a cow scritchy thing. A cow scratching pulse. This is probably a milking shed. Oh, just a feeding shed.
Salz. Whoa, how is this still running? <laughs> Looks pretty fucked up. All right, that's where my truck is there. It's pretty gross. <laughs> I don't even know how it started up the first time. Speaking of which, we should probably... I feel like I've done a bit of damage to this truck. Ah, no, not so bad. Let's bring all this home. We're gonna go left at the junction and then stick on the road. There we go. I was like, oh god, it sounds so terrible. Just needed to get out of second gear. closed. Apparently I'm just aiming for lampposts now. Ugh. Ammo. Lame. Eh? Well, that wasn't very interesting. Oh, nice. Oh, hey, gas station. We. Sweet. 
started getting crampy. No, not a rotten burrito. Ah, I'll bet some frozen ones. You'll get a fresh frozen one. I don't need a, the um, cockroach right now. I'm pretty good on cockroaches. Can't resist. I guess I can top up on gas while I'm here. Wait, what? No. even like even doing that it looks so fucked up This playlist has just been so weird. Yeah, exactly.
I know how to do gas stations. Shut up. Working at the car wash. doing anything. I'm disappointed. Look why it's such a large trailer, it's ridiculous. fries, rotten burgers. Oh, we definitely have someone in here. I'm so fancy with my hat and kitty ears.
Hello, can I have that? Onion rings, rotten. I kind of love all these little Bain Marie's. Oh no! Oh, that's bonkers and lower heart. Like with all the, the mountains around it? That's bizarre. Was it up towards like Like where in Lower Heart was it? it can't have been near Petoni way. Like at the Petoni end. How curious. Alright, I'm gonna go get my cooking pot. Oh, yeah, I was gonna say that makes sense, actually. Yeah, I was trying to think, it's like if it formed like any further up, it would have been broken up even by the river. But hopefully no one was hurt. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense because you do get some doozy um, storms coming in off however, especially if you've got a subtly blowing in. need that much. That's just silly. Hmm. 
I know uh, I had a friend who was affected. There was one up on the coast up by Paikokariki, like Paraparam. Um, he mentioned that. It's kind of bonkers, man. Oh no! <laughs> Well, I mean, to be fair, that's not like, you know, you worry about earthquakes around there. Because, you know, the Hutt Valley is just a big fucking fault line, but... <laughs> you wouldn't expect to worry about tornadoes. Not with all the hills and stuff around there. It's a traditional beef, 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 and beef stew. Okay. I don't think I ever remember... Like, I used to live out in Kilburnie, so I'd see the wind... Like... I saw the... L I saw wind like heal the lid off a, a hangar at the airport. Um, like one of the little small ha air, uh, hangars, like peel the lid off like a, a sardine can. But I guess there's too much shear in Kilburnie to even like have that meat stew. No, this is just like this is like big chunks of meat with maybe a little bit of meat water. And I think when I... I mean, it got bloody windy in Johnsonville. Oh, hi, Toast. I don't know how long have you been sitting in there waiting for me to shut up. Jumped in. <laughs> um... Yeah, well, I lived up in Johnsonville, so that's up pretty... It's got some elevation, but again, it's, it's just too hilly for that sort of formation to, to form, I think. I just realized I really need to wee. I missed an air break again. I got myself something to drink and the boys a snack. Nice. Prickly. Go with Prickly. Instead of gossip girl, go piss girl. Go piss. Yeah. Oh, go pit. Right. I, I'm picking up what you're putting down. It's fine. I see you picking up and putting down a lot of things. <laughs> yes. It's up. I really do. I, this is not a safe space. Well, I mean, it probably is fine. Or I could just like log out. I'm going to do that actually. I'm just going to log, log out so I can go wee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I am. I'm going to log out so I don't get eaten. Key pressure. Am I out? 
taking a really long time to exit the game. Okay, I'll be right back. Okie doke. The urge to be silly is very tempting. We'll be right back after this brief intermission. And Flint is gross. Reticulating spline. <laughs> this looks like you. And welcome back. Thanks. Quickly, there. <laughs> Quickly, there is a, a pushing decoration on there. We have to have a, a pushing decoration in every month for Prickly. The thing we do now. Not that one though.
I'm like panicking because I had to go wee and I'm like I just log out of the game. Pushing the button for pushing, eh? There you go! Oh, that was easy. Yay! Prickly has quite a soft spot for pushing. Integration? Perfect. So I forgot that. I don't know if you saw earlier. Uh, Flint was being a goofball. We were joking at the start of stream about cardboard boxes and how I was stashing cardboard boxes in game. And he's like, "What? Like IRL?" And I was like, "Yeah, yeah, whatever. Funny, funny." And he's like, "We're surrounded by them." I'm like, "I'm not." And then I forget the conversation and go to the bathroom. And open my door to this. He stacked boxes <laughs> in my doorway. So I moved them in front of his door. Completely forget I do it. Open the door again on my second bio break, and I'm like, what the fuck? He just came out and opened the door and was like, I knew you were gonna do that. I'm like, well, of course I would. <laughs> Why wouldn't I? Oh, this isn't where I wanted to be. I know why I told him that. It's like, I honestly thought that I just had like a lot of birthday presents come in and I was all excited for a minute. <laughs> and then I was like, oh, they're just empty boxes. Wow. Well, I mean, pretty mean. Sounds interesting. I appreciate the lurky turkey. You can still go in the freezer.
Oh, okay. That sort of stuff, man, it... <laughs> it accumulates. Like my 60-something granny squares that I've got to make. That's perfect. Now I've got a big smiley face. I'm gonna figure out how to put all this shit away. While navigating a front yard full of flamingos. Actually, it shouldn't be too bad because I have some organization. So, let's do it a category at a time. Easy. Yeah, I had a, a few little boops and bumps on my adventures this evening. Right. Apparently they were having a party without me. <laughs> the rollers on the dress, it's a good look. <laughs> It's a zombie apocalypse. We've got a beverage station. We've got a coffee machine. We have a toaster. Oh. 
Sadly, I think the recipe for toast in the game might be uh, borked. I mm. tried to make toast. I made a couple slice, couple bread loaves, sliced them. It wouldn't toast. <sighs> Terrible. But I did make burgers. Ooh. I am offering you a burger. Oh, thanks. Oh, Flo burger. Flo burger. Meat, cheese, and cabbage. You know what? I'd eat that. That reminds me of a. Hmm. There was a Trinidad and Tobago food truck down the road and they have these like ground beef it's like a sandwich like an open sandwich but it's ground beef but it's got like a, a fried cabbage in there and it's so fucking delicious it's ridiculous like it has no right being as tasty as it is All right. Well, what's on this one? Nothing. What about this one? <laughs> I've got some leftover enchiladas. Or uh, for dinner this evening. Might make some burgers actually in my freezer. Midnight burgers. Sounds good. I don't have any cabbage, but I do have meat and cheese. Absolutely. Thank you for asking. made and we don't even oh shit that sounds good straight away <gasps> Ooh. yes oh man even their salads look good okay i gotta take a look Ooh, i like that sandwich yeah it looks it just they all look kind of yum the runs a sandwich. like in the center of the country. I 
I was really scared to go back in that farmhouse because I knew how many zombies were there. That's reasonable. I think it might have been a spawn center. Yeah, there were definitely a few there. I was there briefly while you were killing stuff, so I, I killed like five or six zombies in the floor and I was still hearing smacks of above and I'm like, uh, I don't know. I may be battle toast, but I am still a chicken. That sounds good too. Ooh, that is good. Bang. I can never decide what I want, so that would be so awesome to have. have a thrift store in your house. Hmm? I do? It kind of looks like a little mini thrift store in the house right now. Perfect. It's kind of cool. Why are doors so hard to get in? Still need a bunch more storage, but I'm getting there. <laughs> the picture that Punky posted in Memes and Silliness is really cute. God,
That new trailer you found is actually in pretty decent condition overall. Much better than the other ones. Considering the what I just put it through, I'm surprised. Well, the other ones have really bad tires and suspensions. Hmm. And I have not really found any decent suspensions. Like, I'd rather find separate parts instead of harvesting them from cars. Hmm. So... I know places where I could go to find some, but it'd be a bit of a drive. Obviously, you need one, yes. Oh, I did get some gloves. Bigger container. Okay, we're making progress here. Electronic stuff up here.
Hi, checking. Just really focused. Yeah, I was slowly, slowly working my way through this mess that is my inventory. <laughs> I'm just checking out some neighboring houses. On my end, because I have your stream muted, I don't hear the music. Yeah. It's like extra silent. It's like super oh. quiet. Yeah. I've I've been enjoying this list, this playlist, but it's so eclectic and weird. Getting there. Oh, you're right, it's definitely got a thrift store vibe. Welcome to Gooder Will.
<sighs> Making progress slowly. Problem is now. I could just like click on the container and be like, okay, now take everything that matches here. Yeah, I was pretty pleased that I found that trailer. To fill all your hoarding needs, you'll always have supplies on the road. Well, I said the problem is when you've got uh, trailer like that is it's really fucking big so uh, you it fills up and then you have to unfill it That's fine. All right, all I've got to do is food. Wow. separate these cans into two.
my poor me. I'm just like, oh, why are you making me ca carry such heavy stuff? See how this goes. I should get like stamina boost for running around with like a hundred kilos of canned veggies on me. I do feel like the fitness and strength thing should they need tweaking. I think they level up way too slow. Yeah. Yes, I have alphabetized the cans. Okay, then. It does make sense. Let me go here. So it's like sauces and spices. Whoopsie. Okay. 
sketch an organization with Tao. We. That's gotta be done. I just keep everything on the shelf. Oh, this I don't. My shelves aren't big enough. But you, don't you know about the biggest shelf? The floor shelf. Yeah, it's always accessible. It is. The problem is it piles spreads on spreads and then you have to like run around hunting for things. But that's all part of the fun. It's no fun. It's an adventure. Mm, no. Okay. been here for 14 years and I still don't know what the difference is. It doesn't help either. means literally nothing. All right, this, I think the system works. Well, <clears throat> Midwest is kind of like you might be in Kansas. So when you say you're not in Kansas anymore, there's a possibility you might be in Kansas. Switching out one, one sort of colloquial term for another doesn't really help. I mean, it doesn't really have much bearing on me, so it's not a, a big deal. the west but in the middle <laughs> thanks see there you go just that, that's the that's the thing with colloquial terms you're like uh what and th that that's fine i guess if you know you know So my first thought would be Chicago, like Illinois is. is well, that, I, that can be a form of the Midwest. I lived there. Like with the automotive industry, but again, I, yeah, I don't know.
All right, what have I got on here? Some soap. Can I put it in that one? No, I can't. That one's full. I honestly don't know why I'm carrying around beta blockers. Chances of even needing them. To avoid beta fish? Well, I mean, I could just not get people's fish tanks. True. Yeah. It is tempting, isn't it? It is. It is, actually. Yeah, sometimes you just want to swim. Right. So I need a blue pan and a red pan. to put that all oh, right here over here No, stop it. Made up lines on Earth are very weird for sure. Especially when you have to put them on a curve. Yeah, and then when you realize, like, well, most people don't. Well, maybe they do now, but like. The image that you have in your head of what the Earth looks like, the Makeda projection, is so fucking wrong and distorted. Like, Especially with this, if you're a flat earther. It's bonkers, like when you actually have a map with the full scale of all the continents and what we think of is the sizes, it's just weird. Alright, so I put like everything away. And now I don't know what I'm missing. Except I could have sworn I had a lot more lighters. scissors. I 
I still don't know why I'm running around with a box of sparklers. Because it's sparkly? Yeah. So I need to make sure I've at least got... Oh. Some whimty sounds. Yes, I can just do this. This might bite me in the butt. We'll see. I don't know if it'll fit. Do some shelves underneath. And I want to grab one of those for me. I'm going to favorite it. So I can't. That's, wow, that's a fancy one. Right, what have I got Great here then? Oh, crafting supplies. It's so nice and neat. We'll see how long it lasts. <laughs> mm hmm. I haven't even bothered, except for the books. I finally sorted them out. These cardboard boxes are disappointingly small. They are. They look like they ought to hold, like, a lot. And it's like, 10? Really? That's it? Yeah, indeed. I'm like, ooh, finally, a place to put all my tires. So small they can only hold two paint cans. Like at that point, the the footprint is larger than the individual items that you would store in it. Mm-hmm. I also made a set of shelves in here, and even the set of shelves was smaller than I thought it would be. Hmm.
So what do we think about the so the game patch for the server? Like I I trust um As long as it won't like do anything to mess up your computer, as long as your computer can handle it. As long well, as it's something. It's that not on my computer. But you do have it's to a... manually install it. Yeah, but it's literally just upload a file to the um the server. Server. And I it's mean, this... tiny. As long it's as a... our as long as our computers can handle all the zombies on there at once, it should be okay. And as long as we don't have to install anything on our own computers, <laughs> that it should be okay. But yeah, I have heard of that, and I did see they did make some updates from the last time I saw that, because I know Molly was actually considering that same mod. At the time, it wasn't updated in such a way where you didn't have to have everyone update, do the manual update, so that's an improvement. Yeah. So, we could try it. I know we've definitely explored a lot more. I know Stu is a huge explorer and very diligent. And we both can be when combined, so. Batten, I think we're getting used to playing. Yeah. Kind of like how like mismatched this is. So for, for belated for Christmas, I made Flint some. I was gonna make Flint some rum balls. Um, and I got the uh, the mix made up, and it's basically it, it's like from like graham cracker crumbs and rum and condensed milk and a few other bits and pieces, and then you you mix it together and it looks fucking disgusting. Uh, but then you put it in the fridge, um, and overnight it. It sort of the the liquids evaporate and it sort of solidifies, and then you roll it by hand into little balls, um, and then you can like roll them in like chocolate sprinkles or powdered sugar or whatever. But it it takes a lot of uh, it takes a lot out of my hands rolling all that stuff. So I just kind of left it there waiting for it. Flynn's decided he's just taking little slices off it, treating it like fudge. I'm like, you know what? That works. <laughs> so next time I think I make it, I'm just going to pour it into a, a casserole dish and slice it up. And instead of rum balls, we can have rum cubes. I seriously put my lighter away again? Yeah, 
Yeah. I mean, it tastes the same. In fact, in some ways, it may even just be better. Hey, why not? Sort of, oh, wait. Where'd I put that? me so much <laughs> it's so silly it's the organizational stuff here I got this badass flashlight and I love it so Right. All right. General crafting stuff. Tools. Yeah, it's it's pretty good. I don't know how big this case is. Ugh. I don't know what to do with all the guns. I don't care about the guns. Even better. Thank you. Oh, that'll make me happy. Can I eat them now? Go for it. Delicious. For those Thank who you. yearn for the soft touch of a pancake. Place with scrap wooden twigs.
I put... Hmm, where did I put my cardboard boxes? Should go in that box. Shelf. The shelf of carrying this. This is where they shall go. That's the, the technical term. All right, that's a, oh, I forgot I still had those little bags. <laughs> All right, that's fine. Wait. Oh, heck. There. Okay, this didn't take as long as I thought it would. So that's good. Also, I need to pee again. I broke the seal. I'm off cycle. I was supposed to pee with ads, but I peed in between an ad break and now it's all thrown out of sync. So I'll be right back. We'll be back after this short break. Call is important to us. And got confused. I feel like I could do with another clothing rack, potentially. And maybe I can get some bookshelves under here. Or some cupboards, cabinets, perhaps. With high enough carpentry, you can actually build some of those. Are you gonna run them over? Yeah, have it. <laughs> it won't make any difference though. Oh, those filing cabinets are so small. So little like bedside tables hold 20. surprised that went there. It's so weird because it looks like it's off sync to the grid. That is a little weird. I'm actually surprised it fit there too. But I'm, I'm okay with that. Thank you. Okay, so those hold 20 as well. All 
All right, I think I'm gonna go look for another clothing store and see if I can. <laughs> Wait, is that a bathrobe? Oh my god, it is. Oh my god, that outfit, the curlers, and the cigarettes <laughs> in the bathroom. That's amazing. I am enjoying that very much. I can make a couple more bookshelves. Or a couple more shelves. There's some materials inside. I don't I don't know what's needed. I just figured at some point I'm probably gonna need more. Just to try and keep everything in one space, but it's not urgent. Eh, it allows me to build up carpentry a little bit. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, this is... I was like, why can't I do anything with this backpack? This this backpack on the floor in here is... Uh, your battle toast bag. Had all the stuff that you had on you when you died. It's like, no wonder it was so heavy. Oh yeah, I found scarves. Turn around and drop this trailer off. It's better. I just tripped over your porch, dropped my hammer, and I probably ruined a shoe. Oh no! <laughs> it was bound to happen eventually. Yep, I destroyed a shoe. It makes no sense between that and trees eating your shoes. I tell Pyro I did that. Holy crap, this truck is... this car is so fast. Yeah, probably. Hey, could you, like... Oh, no, stop it. Yeah, I reckon. We got like the Goldilocks trio of trailers here. Yeah. Trying to keep my yard tidy, you know? Because the old man down the road complained about all the cars in my yard. 
if you offer him some underpants, he'll usually complain less. <laughs> yeah, I went for I, I went for a '90s theme today, and honestly, kind of loving it. That's that's better. So the the cars are organized. Oh, nice! <gasps> That's amazing, Toast. Thank you. We got extra storage in here for I don't know what. I guess it's basically. It seems like on any one wall segment you can store through whatever shopping method 50 items. Or 50 kilos, whatever. Because these shelves hold 50 and that's 30 plus 20 at the bottom. So any square, I guess, has a capacity of 50, however the storage is. Look at this organization, Revy. Make me happy. Just still don't know where to put all my guns, though. I might just put them upstairs. I have no interest in using guns. Not even really going out of my way to collect them. I've got a closet up there. I should just grab and put them up there and be done. Ready! for the raid. I hope you'll head nice strum. Shocked. Absolutely shocked. Oh no, oh that's frustrating.
All right, did I get it? Got all that stuff. Wash on the toilet. I'm not going to wash in the toilet. So many storage containers here. Ooh, actually. I know what I'm going to do here. advantage of this shelving that you bought. <laughs> like, can, can I help you with something? Is there something I can get you? We have only the finest goods. I have something for you, and I think you might be someone who understands the humor. Oh dear. <laughs> All right. Check out the contents of the sewing kit. Wait, wait. Um, equip it secondary. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's brilliant. I love it. <laughs> Yes. Very good, Toast. Love it, love it, love it. <laughs> Perfect. That's that's going upstairs. That's gonna go on my in my room. I don't know which my room is that that's what that's gonna be my room for now. That's perfect. What am I trying to- oh right, my... Alright, so we've got essential little tools and then just like general tools underneath. And then we've got crafting with space for overflow. Wait, hairspray is crafting? Used it. Oh, all right. Oh, padlocks do have a function. It actually says on the tooltip that they can lock containers.
I am peakish. Okay. My garage is empty. Pretty much, except for some gardening stuff, which is fine. Let's cook something. What have we got in here that's stale? Chicken. Stale. Sure, we'll take that. Only the best for me. Pretty sure I can't put a frozen lemon in a stew. I can't, pretty sure I can't put a normal lemon in a stew. You'd probably have to put a stew lemon in a stew. Hmm, that makes sense. Keys. A beardless variety. Yeah, yeah, beard always beardless. The bearded variety would complain. At least they like lemons. I was talking about putting a bearded variety in the stew, the bearded lemon would complain. Oh, yes, no, you're right. It's after midnight again. How did that happen? At least it's Friday slash Saturday. Yeah. Guess maybe I'll skip the very late midnight burgers. Apparently the stale chicken is very boring. It's probably not very exciting, so I'd imagine that. Okay, no worries. Yeah, I put all the, like, ingredients right next to the stove so I can just sort of... don't have to rummage around. Why won't you let me... Oh, right there. Never mind. Chicken, beans, 
in peace to your... Honestly, that sounds fine. Yeah. Especially beardless. Yeah, no beards on this dude. It which might be so good that you could get Stu in the beard. You can get stew in the beard, but you can't get mm. beard in the stew. Yeah. It's like the opposite of you can take the girl out of Vegas, but not the Vegas out of the girl, or whatever the fuck that's supposed yeah, to mean. The blue. Burble, burble. Waiting for it to finish. So tomorrow, uh, I haven't heard otherwise from Coder, so it probably will be trucks to start off with. Um. And then we'll see how the evening goes. I'm enjoying it, but I don't want to burn out on it, on this. Sorry, you're probably hearing weird sounds. That's because I got Flint stream up. I'm waiting for him to read chat. Uh, right. There is some stew in here. Yay. Guess I'll refreeze the peas. Just, it just pleases me. <laughs> My little shelves. Why go out to the thrift store when you can bring the thrift store to you? Yeah. He never looks at his fucking chat. Uh, Alright, he read chat. That's all I can ask for. So many dances, it's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. They're fun though. They are good. All right, I think. I've done. I've done good. We've done organized things. Oh, you know what? I haven't checked out your freshly arranged library. Oh, for fuck's sake. Why did I jump over that? Trade some bloody footprints into your house. Oh, look, that looks lovely. Very nice. Yay. Good job. Oh, 
Oh yeah, paint. See, actually, now the nice thing is, I, now I've got organization, I can start collecting some other stuff. Maybe whoever comes in here next time is going to be like, whoa, what is this? All right. Let's see who is on. It's pretty quiet in the world of the Twitch tonight. Yeah, it is. Your Discord's here. Alright. Look for... Too hard. <laughs> Sometimes it's just really hard trying to find a raid target. It's just like, look, you kind of want to like keep with the game and you want to keep with the vibe, but you worry, you know, you might land on someone who's not fun. And there's so many different tags now that it's like I have no idea. I'm just gonna send her over to Ms. Jinx. She's doing knitting. And she's really lovely and sing songs. Um I will be back tomorrow from 4 p.m. Eastern, probably with some trucks. Um, and uh, yeah, some more of this maybe in the evening, or we may not do some more of this until next week. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but thank you for hanging out and keeping me company. Have a good evening. Uh, here are the raid messages, which I still haven't fucking fixed. Here's the sub one without the scuffed bullshit. And, uh... Yep. Wumbling in with Adele, Wade. Yep. Alright. And I will see you later. My button's not working again. I need to poke at my buttons. Alright. <laughs>